Okay, we're just going to do this, you know, like a quick little video on this because, uh, you know, we really don't have much to say about this, but we did want to um, comment on this. Um, my wife is that type that she's trying to, you know, she does her hair and stuff like this. So um, her thing is she likes straightening her hair. She likes it straightened. And uh, we did have a different iron. Can you get your old and the new she has this flat iron and what happened is they said they're like ceramic plates and I think it's just like a coating or a Teflon coating on the ceramic or a, a shitty ceramic coating on there and what happens is a lot of uh, ladies out there will know and I guess like guys nowadays too but <laughs> Uh, these these thi well yeah there's some stylists right that, there's some guys out there that, that know what the fuck they're doing out there. so the uh, it uh, the brand she had was Andis and I know that company so the brand she had is Andis and I I actually think I purchased this knowing this brand from like hair clippers and stuff like that I don't know where we got it we might have got it at TJ Maxx and you see it says ceramic on there it says multi heat ceramic and this does go up to 450. Um, but show the inside plates. So I don't know if that's just like a ceramic like infused coating that they put on there or, or like a ceramic or some kind of Teflon coating or some kind of coating that had a little bit of ceramic or whatever or there if the plates are ceramic and then it's coated with Teflon or something. But women know that when you buy these flat irons, you know, these tools, beauty tools or whatever stuff like that starts to happen ladies don't like it and yeah it seems like of course where's all those you know paint chips the flakes the dust powder or whatever where's that shit going you know and also like the feeling like when you're ironing it ruins the feeling so she said maybe get me another iron and i seen this one has a ton of reviews let yourself shine in case you guys can't read upside down <laughs> Um, ton of reviews. It seems like women really liked it, and they said it seems like it doesn't. Yeah, there you go. It's a stupid phone. And here's some of the information here. In case people are interested and they know about this stuff. You can read it, and she'll show you. She just used this last night, and it has the temperature here. It'll light up like yeah. a LED it'll light through and she can show the buttons on the sides she did have trouble with this as she's while I'm ironing and pressing the button yeah she's pressing the buttons by mistake has a nice uh, sateen feel to it she just used this uh, last night to straighten her hair feels heavy duty and now the plates they're gonna be very interested in the plates how do the plates hold up if you can show Any problems? How did it feel when you yeah, were... It's really smooth compared to the other one. It's like rough. Yeah, it's rough already because you lost that oh. that, that that coating, that yeah, it's Teflon. It's like, like a non-stick pan. <laughs> yeah, it's like a non-stick fucking pan. You know, it needs to be have that slick surface. I like this too. Like you can... Yeah, it's a nice uh, connection that they give you there, like swivel. Um, titanium plates... And supposedly they're full titanium. I don't know, fully titanium. I don't think they are. I think there's a coating on there or something. But so far, you know, first try seems, seems okay. And she liked it. It's very smooth. Of course, I think all of these are going to be smooth as long as they maintain that coating. But you see, like on the other, the Andes we showed, the coating started coming off right away I think on day one when you used it right away the coating started showing yeah. like it was coming off yeah. and you know I don't want you guys to think that she's using that iron all the time when that coating came off no back in the day she used it like what three times maybe and that three four times boom all that coating what you've seen like most of that came off so auto auto shut off safety mode in one hour <laughs> Personally, I think the auto safety shut off should be like after two minutes or something, not even. Because like if it's not detecting movement or a very, uh, the temperature, turn it this way. 
to show the plates. If it's not detecting any kind of uh, differences in the temperature, fluctuations or whatever, it should turn off right away. One hour gives that tool plenty of time to burn down your fucking house. So, uh, you see that light up there? Two meter power cord and you can do that conversion yourself. Yeah. If you can, yeah. And it does have some residue from the, the hair stuff she was using. I don't know if you can wipe that off. <laughs> the toilet paper. Uh, two meter power cord, you can do that. Uh, 360 swivel cord, like I said, uh, uh, like she said. I don't know what a PTC heater is. Um, fast and safe heat up, 30 seconds ready to use. 3D floating, uh, 3D floating titanium plate, avoid snagging hair. LCD uh, digital display flashes and keeps uh, light, keeps lit, I guess, to uh, show you uh, the temperature. Uh, this is a 100 to 240 volt, um, 11 levels of adjustable temperature from 130 Celsius, or that's 130 Celsius or 265 Fahrenheit, up until 230 Celsius, 450 Fahrenheit. So, just to give you guys like a little bit of uh, information, a little bit of thing, a <laughs> little bit of information. Um, yeah, so she liked it. Of course, these are really smooth. And I think this is, these, these are really slick, glossy ass looking mirror like, shiny like glass fucking plates on there. And her Andis one wasn't even like that. You know, you already know like these Teflon plates or Teflon cookware. You know, they're not even that glossy, shiny, glassy, kind of smooth, right, on the inside of the pan. They're not. You know, some of the ceramic ones are getting there, but you can still see some, some bumps. These are really, really good. Um, they look really nice. And it's really good feel, like you said, when you're... Yeah, smooth. Yeah, when you're straightening the hair and stuff like that. Uh, one thing I did notice is on the Amazon listing, the plates kind of look like um, in an angle. And I'll try to like, uh, kind of like this. Okay. Kind of like that. The plates will look like this on Amazon and some of the photos are on eBay, one or the other. They'll look like this and it'll... So I said to myself, oh, maybe that angle gives it like a better you know straightening effect or power or whatever <laughs> like when you're you know like more force or you know as it's coming if as the hair is getting you know as it's pulling through the hair it's able to have more effect or something but if you close that jinky and then show the tip i don't know if you guys can see but it doesn't seem it's that it's like that in the in the listings like i said it's showing like the plates like this like opening and closing so there is an angle but when i checked here it doesn't seem like there's an angle on those plates so that's something you know you might be concerned with or be curious but uh, she used it. Seems like she liked it. So far on the first, very first try, seems like um, everything's okay. You know, we will update this in the future, but we just wanted to touch on this and let people know because, of course, you know, this is some stuff that people are very curious about. You know, they just wonder, like, how these are. Uh, so we're not getting paid. We didn't get it for free, right? Um, she needed it, so I got it for her. And uh, this is around, I think, 50 bucks. Um, it's kind of expensive. And what I liked about their listing is they're like, <laughs> one of the photos said, like, uh, if you have the money to pay for a flat iron or some of these, you know, tools that are over 100 bucks or 100, around 100, something like that, we advise that. But if not, like, they're, they're basically saying, like, we're the next best thing, you know. And it might be true. Like I said, those plates look good. They said, uh, some people commented that they're solid titanium or something like that. I don't think so. <laughs> I think whatever that is, it's some sort of coating or amalgam or mix or whatever you want to say. And maybe there's titanium there in it somewhere. 
I don't, I really don't know. Or maybe beneath that. And just whatever's on these plates are just, is just really, really good. I don't know. But uh, it, in my opinion, this might turn out to be like a chrome plate uh, over, a chrome plating over titanium or some shit like that. I really don't know because I've seen, <laughs> you know, like, I, I've, I, I have titanium, you know, stuff here. Um, I have a tool uh, made with it. It's pure titanium. And that was uh, given to me by my father. And these don't look the same. Titanium is silver. <laughs> titanium is not copper <laughs> color. So I don't know what kind of coating that is on there. Or I don't know like how they incorporated titanium into this. But on the first use... On the Andes, like I told you, is like a it seems like a Teflon coating, or one of those like ceramic infused coatings or whatever you want to call it. And on the very first use, I started noticing some some of that coating come off. So this one, however, this one uh, the one the Andes you used, you used that right away on 450. This one. 350. 355 so she didn't even get up to 450 yet you know i think what we'll maybe do is we'll we will do a follow-up on this um if she does decide to use it she's not going to be able to use it for a while though so sorry about that but yeah first impression seems great very smooth uh gliding uh through the hair or whatever uh, seems seems nice so it seems like it's well built so we'll see so if you guys did watch all the way thanks sorry if we can't you know make everybody happy and have you know full you know information you can on some of our videos you can send us messages and we might even do like a video response like I'm planning for one of the other uh, uh, questions we had you know we'll, we'll try to respond sometimes we turn the, the comments off on some videos because some people like to be smart ass like it's like they ruin everything it's like they go on there and they like to like talk shit and i we don't want to like give that pleasure to somebody if that's how they find their like enjoyment you know like fucking with people and ruining their mood their days and that makes them happy we'd rather just take that away from them that way maybe they'll you know like yeah, I don't know what back the fuck off and just like knock off the fucking bullshit like it's okay to come in and make a comment and it's like a little bit of a smart ass comment but it's kind of serious you're like making a point or something like that but when you come in and onto these videos that I watch and they're just like it seems like they're fucking full of rage that they just want to just talk so much shit and just like ruin someone's like mood their day and it's just like make them miserable maybe it's like misery loves company or something like that you know it's just like on there just talking shit and saying you know mean things just to be like mean and make themselves feel better or some shit like that but i mean that's not cool you know i i see some of these videos and they, like i didn't see anything wrong with the person what they did or anything like that and then people come in with these fucking comments and they're just like blast this person for no good reason it's just like that's it's like why would you say that shit to someone like 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 knock that shit off grow the fuck up like would you like someone to fucking do that to you like out of nowhere you're just like hey guys i'm doing this video like uh you know, support my channel blah 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 whatever um you know, let you guys know like how i like this whopper at burger king or some shit like that i don't know and then people are just like you're the ugliest motherfucker so gross it's like damn like <laughs> I don't know how some people were raised, but anyways, if you did watch, thanks. We do a lot of other videos and stuff like that. Feel free. We appreciate it if you guys are watching and stuff like that. So if you guys do watch or subscribe or you know, keep up with some of our videos, great. Thank you so much. Take care.